Welcome everybody, and what's up to Skyrim. Now, when we left off, we are going to talk to the Yarl of Whiterun. So let's go do that and hop right into so, it. So, you were at Helgen. You saw this dragon with your own eyes? Nope. Dude next to me saw it. I, I didn't see it. I had some dust in my eye. I couldn't really tell. Yes, I had a great view while the Imperials were trying to cut my head off. Really? You're certainly forthright about your criminal past. I didn't do crap. But it's none of my concern who the Imperials want to execute, especially now. What I want to know is what exactly happened at Helgen. Because if I vaguely remember, they didn't know who I was. But they're like, you know what? Screw it. I'm in a murdering mood. Let's destroy this kitty. They're animal herders. Ladies and gentlemen out there and the, watching my video, don't hurt animals. It's not cool. Uh, the Imperials were about to execute Ulfric Stonecloak, then the dragon attacked. Hmm. I should have guessed Ulfric would be mixed up in this. Yes. What do you say now, Proventus? Shall we continue yeah. to trust in the strength of our walls against the dragon? My lord, we should send troops to Riverwood at once. It's in the most immediate danger. If the Jarl dragon Ulfric is lurking in the mountains... view that as a provocation. He'll assume we're preparing to join Ulfric's side and attack him. We should Enough. not... I'll not stand idly by while a dragon burns my hold and slaughters my people. Irileth, send a detachment to Riverwood He does not once. look like he's impressed at all. Yes, my Jarl. If you'll excuse me, I'll return to my duties. That would be best. Well oh. done. You sought me out on your own initiative. <clears throat> You've done White Run a service. Thanks. And I won't forget it. Oh, you're gonna make me blush. Take this as a small token of my esteem. Yeah. There is another thing you could do for me. Suitable for someone of your particular talents, perhaps. Whoa. Gar. Are you hitting Let's on me? Find Faringar, my court wizard. He's been looking into a matter related to these dragons and Rumors of dragons. No, dragons. Now where is it? It takes a while to make a dress, Dagny. You have to be patient. But I don't want to be patient. I want a dress right now. Father promise. All you ever do is complain about what you want. You're a spoiled baby. Oh! I'm going to tell Father you said that. Who oh, tan your hide for sure? One of the new servants? Remember that I like my meat. Father warrior. says I'm too young to train with the sword, so I practice with my fists. So do I. Okay. Faringar. You want a blowjob or something? Is that what we're doing here? You want some special stuff. Go Whoa. ahead and fill him in with all the details. So the Earl thinks you can be of use to me. Yeah. Oh yes, you must be referring to my research into the dragons. Yes, I could use someone to fetch something for me. Well, fetch. when I say fetch, I really mean delve into a dangerous ruin in search of an ancient stone tablet that may or may not actually be there. Okay, where am I going and what am I fetching? Straight to the point, eh? No need for tedious hows and whys. I like that. Leave those details to your betters, am I right? No. I, uh, learned of a certain stone tablet said to be housed in Bleak Falls Barrow. A dragon stone said to contain a map of dragon burial sites. Go to Bleak Falls Barrow, find this tablet, no doubt interred in the main chamber, and bring it to me. Simplicity itself. Oh, you mean this old stone? Da, 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 da. Ah, the dragon stone of Bleak Falls Barrow. You already found it. Cut from a yeah, I got an achievement. Woohoo, ghosty. So, what about my reward? You'll have to see the Jarl about that. Maybe Damn Steward Avenici. I'm sure one of them will pay you appropriately. Yeah, I don't care what you have to say.
Farangar, you need to come at once. A dragon's been sighted nearby. You should come too. A dragon? How exciting. Where was it seen? What was it doing? I'd take this a bit more seriously if I were you. If a dragon decides to attack Wyfun, I don't know if we can stop it. Let's go. Okay, I guess we're gonna do more some more stuff. I just wanted to go do some awesome storyline stuff. So, Yurilef tells me you came from the Western Watchtower. Yes, my lord. Tell him what you told me about the dragon. Oh, that's right. We saw it coming from the south. It was fast, faster than anything I've ever seen. What did it do? Is it attacking the Watchtower? No, my lord. It was just circling overhead when I left. I never ran so fast in my life. I thought it would have come after me, for sure. Good work, son. We'll take it from here. Head down to the barracks for some food and rest. You've earned it. Irileth, you'd better gather some guardsmen and get down there. I've already ordered my men to muster near the main gate. Good. Don't fail me. There's ah. no time to stand on ceremony, my friend. I need your help again. Uh. I want you to go with Irileth and help her fight this dragon. You survived Helgen, so you have more experience with dragons than anyone else here. But I haven't forgotten what? the service you did for me in retrieving the dragon stone for Faringar. As a token of my esteem, I have instructed Avenici that you are now permitted to purchase property in the city. And please, accept this gift from my personal armory. I should come along. I would very much like to shield a resistance. No. All this standing around is rubbish. Well, I guess we're gonna go fight a dragon. Oh yeah. We're gonna fight a dragon. Oh Good man. Luck. I hope you get there in time. Yeah, I do too. Um We're just gonna fast travel. Cause I'm lazy. But oh man guys, it's gonna be our first time to uh Fight a dragon with our fist. Like, this is actually pretty exciting. I beat that one guy in Bleak Fall Barrels with my fist pretty freaking quick. So, this should be actually very interesting. A lot of people have been telling me that using my fist throughout this entire game is not the best plan ever. Because it is my fist. So, we're gonna have some fun and experiment and see now I will probably use my bow just to get it down no signs of any dragon right now but it sure looks like he's in here I know it looks bad we've got to figure out what happened and if that dragon is still skulking around somewhere spread out and look for survivors we need to know what we're feeling. Now I'm gonna use my bow just for the dragon. Actually, no. We're just gonna use the fist. We're gonna wait until the dragon drops. We're gonna heal when we need to. And when the dragon drops in the ground, we're gonna run up to it and just punch it right in the face. So we're gonna see what's gonna happen here. No, get back. It's still here somewhere. Proki and Tor just got grabbed when they tried to make a run for it. Guardsmen, what happened here? Where's this dragon? Quickly now! I don't know. Kinder, let's save us. Here he comes again. Here he comes. Find cover and make every arrow count. Okay. I'll make every arrow count. Yeah. Whoa. Oh, it's over there. Come on. Wow. 
well. We did some decent damage to it with my fist, but... Actually, I'm pretty sure he gave me some new apparel, so we're gonna... Come on, buddy. There you go. Oh, don't be a douche. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, look at that moon planet thing. Come on, buddy. Why are you all the way over there? You just shot a fireball at me. Yay! Dovakin! No! What the hell are you calling Dovakins? What do you have? You got some arrows, dragon, gold. Eh. Whoa. So we did it, guys! We beat a dragon with our fist. That'll be very interesting to see how it happens when I'm alone. Not when I have six other guys trying to, you know, attack it. Use the shout section of your magic menu to equip your unrelenting force shout. Magic. Shout. Unrelenting force. Use your new. Let's see. I. I can't believe it. You're dragonborn. You look like you have half your face burned off. Dragonborn? What do you mean? In the very oldest tales, Meow. from when there were still dragons in Skyrim, the dragonborn would slay dragons and steal their power. That's uh, what you huh. did, isn't it? Absorb the dragon's power. I think you may be right. You are a freaking genius! I don't know what happened to me. There's only one way to find out. Try to shout. That would prove it. According to the old legends, only the Dragonborn can shout without training, the way the dragons do. Dragonborn? What are you talking about? That's right. My grandfather used to tell stories about the Dragonborn. Those born with the Dragonborn. Oof! Power of old, my voice of the Dragonborn. I've never heard I wish I could be like, ah! and just push someone. There weren't any dragons then, idiot. They are just coming back now for the first time in forever. But the old tales tell of the dragonborn who could kill dragons and steal their power. You must be one. What do you say, Irleth? You're being awfully quiet. Come on, Irleth. Tell us. Do you believe in this dragonborn business? Hmm. <laughs> Some of you would be better off keeping quiet than flapping your gums on matters you don't know anything about. Here's a dead dragon, and that's something I definitely understand. Now we know we can kill them. But I don't need some mythical dragonborn. Someone who can put really? down a dragon is more than enough for me. You wouldn't understand, Housecar. You ain't an all. Huh. I've been all across Tamriel. I've seen plenty of things just as outlandish as this. I'd advise you all to trust in the strength of your sword arm over tales and legends. That was shouting what you just did. Must be. You really are dragonborn then. Are we done here? Like, what do we need to do? Oh, I gotta report back to him. Okie dokie. Oops. Just we'll fast travel the white one. And we will report back to him, and I think that'll be it for this episode. We'll see what he has to say, what he's gonna give me. You already have been told you're not allowed here. Turn around and go back the way you came. We're causing no trouble. All we ask is to... I don't care what you are. Oh. You're lucky I don't toss you in jail. Now get close. We will be back. Ow. No clue what that was. Well, that was disturbing. 
Damn those gray mains to oblivion. They want to back the storm cloaks, they'll get what's coming to them. I just love how I walk past someone and they open like a conversation with me. And normally they're kind of douches. Good, you're finally here. The Yarl's been waiting for you. So what's up, bro? About the watchtower. What's the dragon there? Hell yeah! I knew I could count on Irileth. But there must be more to it than that. When the dragon died, I absorbed some kind of power from it. So it's true. The Greybeards really were summoning you. The Greybeards? Masters of the Way of the Voice. They live in seclusion, high on the slopes of the throat of the world. What do these Greybeards want with me? Do they want to touch me? Because I'm not really about all that. I prefer a little younger uh, people, not some gray beards. Because if they have gray beards, that's kind of out of the my mind. Dragonborn is said to be uniquely gifted oh. in the voice. The ability to focus your vital essence into a thum or shout. If you really are Dragonborn, they can teach you how to use your gift. You heard the summons. What else could it mean? The Greybeards. Didn't you hear the thundering sound as you returned to Whiterun? That was the voice of the Greybeards, summoning you to High Hrothgar. This hasn't happened in centuries, at least. Not since Tiber Septim himself was summoned when he was still Talos of Atmora. Rungar, calm yourself. What does any of this Nord nonsense have to do with our friend here? Capable as he may be, I don't see any signs of him being this... what? Dragonborn. I don't know. Like nonsense. Why, you puffed up ignorant. These are our sacred douche. traditions that go back to douche, the founding douche, of the douche, First douche. Empire. Prongar, don't be so hard on Avenich. Yes. I meant no disrespect, of course. Uh huh. It's just that, what do these Greybeards want with him? That's the Greybeard's business, not ours. Yeah, Baldy. Whatever happened when you killed that dragon? It revealed something in you, and the Greybeards heard it. I did fart. They think you're well, I'm a really cool kitty. Who are we to argue? You'd better get up to High Hrothgar immediately. There is no refusing the summons of the Greybeards. It's a tremendous honor. I envy you, you know, to climb the 7,000 steps again. I made the pilgrimage once. Did you know that? High Hrothgar is a very peaceful is he done talking? place. Oh, no, he's very talking. disconnected from the troubles of this world. I wonder that the Greybeards even notice what's going on down here. They haven't seemed to care before. No matter. Go to High Hrothgar. Learn what the Greybeards can teach you. You've done a great service for me and my city, Dragonborn. By my righteous yarl. Ah, uh, why you give me a weapon? I don't use it. It's the greatest honor that's within my power to grant. I assign you Lydia as a personal Ooh, house carl, and this weapon from my armory to serve as your badge of office. I'll also notify my guards of your new title. Wouldn't want them to think you're part of the common rabble, now would we? Uh, no, sir. We are honored to have you as thane of our city, Dragonborn. Back to business, Proventus. We still have a okay. city to defend. Oh, yes. Lydia! The Jarl has appointed me to be your house, Carl. It's an honor to serve you. Lead the way. Alrighty, we got Lydia! Woo! Alright, everybody. That's going to do it for this episode of Skyrim Special Edition. We beat up a dragon with our fist. And almost died because of it. But, to no avail, I am still using my Kitty Paws of Fury. Now, remember to hit that like button if you enjoyed the video. Comment anything you want. Preferably uh, ways I can make the videos better. Um, and hit that subscribe button if 
you want to be notified when I make new videos or when I stream, because I do stream sometimes. Mm, maybe so, maybe not. Who knows? But you will if you hit that subscribe button. So remember, keep calm and love pandas.